everybody, Mr. Miola here, and welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. Here's our little eccentric looking fellow who's looking better than ever right today. He's got his top hat on, he's got his furry, flamboyant, multicolored war, war chest. I don't even know what this thing's called anymore, but we're standing here in front of all of our best dinosaurs. In fact, I kind of messed up right for a second as I was supposed to hit K to flip my view like this. I said, I hit, I hit J instead and all my dinosaurs came. Actually, only one of them. Only ass there. I, I went and hit J, which makes all your dinosaurs follow you, which, yeah, looks like a couple of them have decided to go and uh, start going astray, but we've been busy since last episode. I've been sick the last few days. I've come down with a bit of a flu type of thing, so I'm toughing it out for this episode, so you guys owe me one. Or you guys who, who be begging in the comments for Daily Ark, you're still only getting it once every two days, but you should be grateful you're getting it today. I'm toughing out a lot of sickness right now to get this one done. But I've got to lined up all of my dinosaurs out here. Like I said, I've been sick, so I've been doing a lot of non-recording type of stuff. Ass, get back in line, buddy. Get back in line. You weren't supposed to leave your line. Down here, though, I've got something to show you because I have been busy. We have ourselves two dinosaurs. Number two, which is a different name, and he's a very high level. He's a level 774 to be exact. And then we've got Rob, the original the original. Now, number two is the is the child of... I don't know where it's gone. Basically, I've been breeding T-Rexes because we're going to be going in, taking on the bosses soon. And apparently, well, my boy Krieg, one of the Discord mods, mods of my private Discord server. You guys who are in the Discord would know who he is. He's done a lot of research for me and he's told me exactly what we got to do to get... Well, basically what we can bring into the bosses. Our best bet. So, I'm breeding up a bunch of T-Rexes. I've gone and modified some of the modifiers to make it a bit easier for us to do. And, uh, well, right now we have number two. I think number one is chilling up there inside of the base. And we've also got one called Roberta. I found me a level, I think it was like a 595 female T-Rex. Perfect team to her with our Drake. And a golden kibble, of course. And she ended up at like close to 900, just below it. So I pumped a couple levels into her already. Um, and yeah, so basically, yeah, we're, we're building up an army of really strong T-Rexes. Um, alphas apparently can't get to the boss arenas, unfortunately, which kind of sucks. And for some reason, we've also got a bunch of wild dinosaurs that have started, you know, spawning inside of my base. Like you just saw them mobbing a bunch of Trudons. I have no idea why that is or what changed or anything like that, but... Hopefully that doesn't backfire in any way. As long as we don't get any wardens or war chiefs or whatever the hell else could spawn inside this base. As long as none of that happens, I'm happy. I'll be right. So let's go and take the Forgotten, who is no longer forgotten for just a moment today. I don't know what she's doing down here. Obviously I hit J, so she must have started flying. But that oh no, she would have got triggered by the Trudons down there. We'll plant you up here. We've got our dragons all chilling up the top here now as well. We got Drogon and Dragon. And then inside the base, we have my two... Well, two of my highest level T-Rexes. My highest level female, Roberta. And then... Well, she was named after Rob. Because Rob and Roberta. But now we've got number one. Because number one ended up breeding to a higher level than Rob was. So, yeah. We're, it's kind of mixed and matching. But we're breeding. And hopefully, what I plan on doing today is breeding these guys... Some more. I've gone and tried to reduce the breeding timer so we can just smash out some new T-Rexes, but we'll see how that goes. So, let's have a look here. This is number one. He's pretty tough. Um, in fact, we can go and throw some levels onto him, can't we? We can! Let's go straight up with the melee damage, because we want the highest damaging animals we can possibly get. We've also got Roberta, who can have some levels, because she's freshly tamed as well. Um, melee damage, melee damage. You know what? Have a large experience potion. Drink on that. 64 levels! That's what I'm talking about, baby! Alright, and I made it so that... Oh, this is gonna get ridiculous. Hold on. What? What? Is... Hold on just a second. How much experience is she gaining from all of these? She's got a hundred... Wait, what? Something... I might have messed something up in the multipliers. <laughs> but stuff it! Who cares? Who cares? I want to take on some bosses, and that's what we're going to be doing pretty darn soon. I don't know what to do with the rest of these levels, though. Maybe we throw some weight up a little bit. That's probably, like, just wasted levels. Um, you know what? Get her to 200,000. Just keep on cranking them on you. You're going to be... Wow, she's nearly level 1,000. That's awesome. How about you? Oh, I want to throw one onto him as well, but... I don't think we will. But let's try and breed these guys. Oh, and I kind of broke a wall over here as well. Um, I, I bred a T-Rex in there and he couldn't get out. 
So I had to break the door and then the whole world came tumbling down. I also went and increased our maximum level because otherwise we couldn't um, unlock the, the Anunnaki Matrix to tame up the Celestial Dragons and stuff like that. So we can actually go and throw 36 levels down on ourselves apparently. Well, I don't know. I just copied and pasted the code that we needed from Google. That's what has helped us do. So let's go to level 600 health and beyond. Let's go to level 700 health. No, and beyond again. Okay, and melee damage. The rest of it's all melee, all melee damage. I should have put more on melee damage, but too late. Now, what I want to see is what do we need for the Matrix stuff. Here we go. Let's learn them both and find out what we need. Five essence of all... Okay, five essence of, of all the Wardens. That's it. Okay, fair enough. We'll get there eventually. Don't you worry. And you know what? I'm actually curious. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We're going to eat. We're hungry. Now that I've increased the maximum level of dinosaurs as well... Does that mean Shenron can have some new levels? No? Oh no. Okay. He's only got 255 experience. I think I really bro <laughs> I think I've really broken something here. Well, he can't level up anymore anyway, so that's fine. That's fine. That's okay. Um, but let's go and breed some more T-Rexes. We're looking for about 20 T-Rexes all up, and I got a feeling these two here are gonna just they're gonna be amazing. So let's enable that wandering. Let's enable that wandering on you as well. And now we just got to wait for him to get nice and close together. And then just spam to sit in the same spot. I don't know what the uh, the mating interval timer is. So hopefully... Are they still... Are they able to breed? Yeah, no, they should be. They're both ready. They're ready for it. I just got to get them close together. Here we go. Here we go. Whoa, my God. Okay. Just... Okay. Just... No, they're outside of the range. I got to get them close together. I need those little red love hearts above their names. Come over here, Roberta, and stay, and stay. That's got to be close enough, right? No? No? Okay. All right. If, if you won't do it, I'll do it for you. Okay? There we go. Oh, and we went through a couple more caves as well, guys. I went back through the really, really hard cave, and I finished that. I figured stuff it ain't going through that again on camera. But let's try and get this done. And I went through another one as well. Can't remember which one that one there was. That one came from another cave. I can't remember exactly, but... Let's breed these guys. Where's the little mating bar? There it is. And we're just going to make sure they don't move outside of the range they're supposed to. We're going to sit here. Keep pressing U. Make sure that they're mating. They're at 24% right now. I thought it'd be moving a little bit faster because I did increase the time. Or I thought, actually, no. Did I decrease it or increase? I thought I decreased the time it takes to mate them, but maybe I didn't exactly. I don't know. For those of you that who though, that have been, asked, been with us for a few seasons... I had a lot of trouble breeding dodos a couple years ago. <laughs> so that was a bit of a learning experience. So everything I've learned about breeding is from back then. Let me just have a cup of my tea. Need a little sip of tea. Mmm. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good. Mmm. Best, the best cure for when you're sick, you got a flu, you got a cold or hay fever, whatever you got. Some tea, some honey, some lemon. Oh, marvelous. It's good stuff. Anyways, I'm going to let these guys keep going until we've got an egg. Until we've got an egg to hatch. We've done it. We've got it, guys. We've got our very first egg. And look at it incubating so quickly. Okay. Thing I want to check, though. Ready to mate in three minutes. Yes. That's it. That's the interval that we need. A three-minute interval between our breeds. It used to be one hour. So instead of waiting one hour. Actually, I think by standard, it's one day. I set it back to an hour for the first one. Now it's three minutes. So we are about to have our, our second or third. I think it's our third. No, second. This is our second or third baby egg. I can't remember which one it is, but here he comes. We're about to have a little baby Roberta. Is it a male or female? Let's find out. What have we got inside the egg? Oh, it's a little baby T-Rex. Let's imprint him before he dies. And I guess, oh, level 692. And what's going to be really cool about this is I've sped up all of the all of the breeding stuff. So we are visibly going to see this guy grow. He is going to grow before our eyes. You can literally see him moving right now. He is going to be massive soon. So let's go and get him out here. Come over here, little juvenile Tyrannosaurus Rex. And you guys might need to give me some names for these guys because we're going to have a lot of T-Rexes in our party today. It's going to get ridiculous. It's going to get insane. But come on. Oh, hey, 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 hey. You're not allowed to leave. You're not allowed to leave up there, number one. You're not allowed to leave. But little, a little juvie fella down here. Come out, little guy. Come out. And you're going to grow out here. Oh, i got to give him meat, don't I? Oh, no, he's all right. <laughs> He'll be fine. 
<laughs> It'll be fine. Uh, some of you might say this is a little cheaty, but you know what I say? <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. There's no way I'm going to beat the bosses anyway on my own, so let's just do this thing. Are you ready to breed another one just yet, Roberta? Are you ready? Where are you? Over here. You ready, Roberta? 46 seconds and she'll be good to go. Woo -hoo -hoo. Um, you know what? Let's grab some meat. Oh, I'm going to stop him from wandering. Where are you, buddy? Hey, sit tight, sit tight, sit tight. Options. Uh, no, we don't want to unclaim him. No behavior. Disable wandering. Okay, so he will not wander around anymore, but he's 50% fully grown. In fact, he's level 692. I can rep Actually, is it a male or female? I didn't even check. Because that could play a difference. Oh, it's a female. So we've got another female. In fact, I should really use him instead of Roberta. Or should I? Probably not. Because once once he fully grows, he's going to be like level 1,000. He is... He's going to rock it. Because the babies are babies. This seem to be high... You know what? Okay, we'll go one more. We can breed them all. Look at them. They're going already. They didn't, have, they didn't even have to wait for me. There's a second one on the way already. As long as they stay close enough together, which hopefully they do. We just got to whistle occasionally to make sure of it. But, uh, yeah, no, we got two high level females now. We can breed them simultaneously at the same time, which means twice, twice the babies, twice the T-Rexes. If we have another female, we can have triple the, triple the babies. Oh, this is going to be good. I'm just going to wait for that other one to fully grow though. We'll bring it back in. We'll let them mate. We'll have another egg. We might need to have another male as well. You know what? I hope this one's a male for that sake then. I hope this one is a male. 36%. Sit tight, guys. How is our now our <laughs> adolescent T-Rex going? He is just about fully grown. Oh, she. I got stuck all in her she. She is just about fully grown. Roberta. Roberta is 50% of the way through it. Hurry up. He's not even moving. Yeah, it's moving. Sit tight, guys. Sit tight. A little pregnant poo-poos. Okay. How about you, buddy? You're nearly there. He's nearly there. He's nearly there. He's nearly there. She. She's nearly there. Why do I keep forgetting that? We've got ourselves a fully grown T-Rex right there. Level 692. I kind of want to see these stats. Melee damage is 1,000. So this is ridiculous. This is just stupid. This is just stupid. How about you? You got a little, little baby on the way? Just... 20 more percent. I should have made the mating quicker, but... Oh, well, we're going to get a couple T-Rexes today. If we can get 10, I'll do the next 10 on my own. Dude, where are you going? I need you to... I need you to... I need you to get Roberta pregnant. Come back! No! It stopped. It stopped. Tell me it didn't reset. Tell me it did not reset. You guys are too slow. No! It reset! It reset! I've got to, like, lock them into place another way. That's what I'm going to do. I also... I'm also going to need a lot of saddles. Let's get you inside. Let's see if you can party with everyone else. I had nowhere else to do this. I needed somewhere nice and compact where they can't just run away and do their own thing. Can we get a bit of a... Can we get a bit of a... Can we get... Can we, can we get two of these breeding at the same time or not? Is that not going to happen? It's not going to be possible? No, it's not going to be possible, unfortunately. That's okay. Well, I'm wa I'll wait for this one to mate in her entirety. And then we'll keep going from there, I guess. Here we go, guys. Baby number two. There we go. Another egg is down. And the question... Oh, should I just leave it? I'll just let it sit there. The question is, will she start breeding with this fella? Oh, no. Will he start breeding? Oh, no. I'm going to set him to wonder. That's what's up. And they were wondering. So will we have a second... Oh, yeah. A second baby on the way already. That's what I'm talking about. We're going to have babies everywhere. It's going to be incredible. 45% of the way there. This is great. This is so good. Hey, T-Rex, you don't need that meat anymore. Wait. Oh, no. I've still got the meat on my body. Well, <laughs> this is a bit ridiculous. This castle was not built with the intention of breeding T-Rexes inside of it. But, hey, who's complaining? We got ourselves another little baby T-Rex. He's a level 782. That's ridiculous. That's higher. That's 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 90 levels higher than that one. And it's a female. Woohoo! We've got another female. Are we all breeding at the same time here or what? Uh, this is this is gonna end badly. They're all gonna get stuck in here if I'm not careful. So we're gonna get someone out of here. Who's uh the lowest level we have here? We're gonna keep her. She's like our our future mum. She's the next mum. I think Roberta, it's time for you to get out of here. 
A level, a level 970. It's time for you to move on, I think. I don't know. Maybe it's time for this one. Once this one here has a baby, we'll get her out of here. Yeah, once once this one lays an egg, we'll get her out of here. You're our next one. You can replace Roberta eventually, I think. Then again, it's only level 782. Like, it's not a, it's not a level 1000 or anything like that. I don't even know if that matters. Ah, oh, well. I think they just reset breeding! No! Stay closer together, you bananas! You morons! What are you doing? <laughs> Alright, let's get you out of here, little juvie. We'll, we'll let the grown-ups do what they gotta do, but we'll... Oh, he's an... He's a... He's, she's an adolescent already! She's an adolescent... Oh, no, you missed... You missed the door there, little guy. You missed the door there, little guy. <laughs> I think he's a bit stuck. I think they're getting a little bit tied up inside the base there. Uh... That's not ideal. Let him out, big boy. Let him out. Come on! Whoa, what did he just bite down to eat? I think they're stuck on one another. Well, that's not ideal. Because he's just going to keep getting bigger and bigger. Um, I need some I need some T-Rex idols. That's what I need. I need T-Rex idols ASAP. Um, so I'm going to take this one. We've only got... We're, we're juggling... Oh my gosh, this is bad. This is bad. How far along? You're, you're slowly breathing. Well, oh, that's good at least. Okay. Number one. I need you out of here, buddy. Okay, there we go. There we go. Now we gotta get <laughs> we gotta get the latest baby out of there. Come on, little baby T-Rex. Where'd you go? I mean, he's not even following me anymore. Come on, little adolescent. You can make it out now. You can make it. You can make it, I believe. I believe. Hold on. Oh no, we can't breathe two at a time in there, can we? There we go! We've got him out! We got him out! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. And I'll, I'll reinforce, I mean. We got her out, of course. We got her out. And she's just about to be an adult as well. Oh, it's a little breeding farm in here. I love it. Now, can you guys stop walking around so you can actually have a baby? That's that's all I'm asking right now. I need a baby out of you guys. Here we go. Baby number three for today. About to be born. Here she goes. Here she goes. Here she goes. We've got ourselves a third baby for today. This is great. This is Marvelous, this is fantastic. Um, I guess we'll just let it sit there and incubate. No. I'll let it I'm actually gonna bring it outside. It's getting a little bit hectic. Oh hey buddy. Hey my T-Rexy friend. Hey, what are you doing over there? What you doing? Um we gotta drop it. Alright, it'll breed out here then. Mr. T-Rex, come over here. Or oh, Mrs. T-Rex. Look after this egg for me, will ya? Look after this egg. She needs to stop wondering. There we go. Now, I'm hoping... I'm really hoping this one's a male. That way... Oh, it's not going to incubate out here, is it? We need the air conditioners. Duh! That's the whole point of it being inside. Oh, by the way, in case I didn't show you guys, I got a little bit of an... Well, oh, I got a little bit of an air conditioner set up in here. Drop you. Okay, now it'll breed. Now it'll incubate or whatever it's got to do. Good, 65%. And you guys are still making babies, right? That's what's going on in here. We good? We good? We good? You can go up some levels. You will go up some levels. Uh, on, on that damage. We gotta get that damage and health nice and high. You, 9%, okay. Melee damage again. Um, why isn't Roberta breeding? Roberta. Why are you not breeding, eh? Are you able to? 30 seconds and then Roberta can breed again. Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go! Another little baby T-Rex! Oh, come outside, little one. Oh, is it a male? That's another female! What is going on? Level 770. So not quite as high as the one outside, but I'll take it. It's all good. It's all good. Come here, little one. Come here, little one. She's stuck in the little room. Come here, little baby T-Rex. Guys, I'm gonna need some names. I'm gonna need some names. And who knows? If I, if I read a name that I like enough, I might even name my real dog. One of the names you guys choose. I'm getting a dog in a couple weeks time. It's a little staffy, and she needs a name. If you follow me on Instagram or Twitters and stuff, you've probably seen some photos of it. Well, let me see those names in the, in the, in the, in the down below today, guys. Uh, let me see some names down below. If there's one that I like enough, not only will I call my T-Rexes after it, I may even name my dog after it. 
How are we looking in here, guys? How? Who is even breeding? Everybody's breeding, apparently. 34%. Are you breeding as well? I think, I think everybody's breeding right now. 3%. Everybody's breeding. We're gonna get two. We're gonna get two eggs. <laughs> Give me two eggs. Give me the double breed. I don't even care. It'll be a nice way to end this episode with like 10 T Rexes. Oh, it's gonna be awesome. That brood mother's not gonna know what, what's coming to it. Oh no. Oh no. Here we go. Another one on the way. Woo. All right. How about you guys over there? You guys still breeding? No? Yes? Yes? I saw it. I saw it stop for a second, but we still have we still have another egg on the way. 72%. It's coming, baby. It's coming. 75. Keep it going. And there we go. We've got ourselves another egg. It's incubating. Oh, hey there, little guy. I nearly missed you. <gasps> Do we have a male finally? Is it a male? It's only a 748, and it's a male. I think that's the highest level male we have, so... That's good. We now have ourselves a high level male. We can actually replace number one with this one, I suppose. Now, I really don't want many more dinosaurs roaming around inside of here, though. And this egg's about to drop as well. We'll find out what level it is in a matter of seconds. Um, you little guy, you gotta follow me. You gotta follow me. And we're gonna find out what we have here as well. I wouldn't mind. Oh, you know what? I don't even care what it is. It's just 692, so it's a bit of a lower level. And it's a male. Okay. Both of you little babies come out here. Come away. Come away. Let's go. In fact, one of them isn't even a baby anymore. One of them's already a juvenile. Didn't even get a chance to leave the base as a baby. It just grew up way too fast. Oh, it's stuck. It's not... <laughs> it can't get through the door. Come on, buddy. You can do it. I believe in you. And he's out of there. Yeah, little juvenile. All right, guys. Welcome to the T-Rex party. In fact, let's go and bring let's go and bring them all down to meet the rest of the family. We still got three inside the base. Hopefully, that will just do what they gotta do and keep on breeding, keep on dropping me some eggs. Cause we can really just sit there, and let them do their thing. The eggs will hatch, the babies will breed, and come back in an hour's time to an infinite amount of T-Rex. In fact, why why haven't I done that? Oh, careful guys, careful. So how much have we got down here? Oh, here's the other one as well. The little juvie one. Okay. Come on, everybody. I want to get them, like, all in a row. I want to get them all standing in a row. Look at them all. This is the best thing ever. Why have I never done this before? Can you guys spread out a little bit? Guys, spread. Spread your booties out. What is the point in all standing in one place at the same time? Spread out. Spread. Spread. <laughs> I just want to count them. One, two... Three, one, two. All right, you're, you're gonna go and walk around for a bit, are you? How about you don't? How about we stop that? No more wandering for you. One, two, three, four, five in there. And then this little guy, six, just absolutely doubled in size. So we got nine T-Rexes all together. Nine all together. Come over here, little baby one. Little baby, come over here. This is the best thing ever. And we're gonna need a bunch of saddles for all of them as well. So we got nine. I'm, I'm hoping we run upstairs and there's an egg waiting for me. Because then we've reached our goal of ten. Roberta, what are you doing? Roberta, no. You're supposed to be inside. What are you doing? Roberta's managed to escape. <laughs> Roberta managed to escape somehow. I don't, I don't know how that happened. But let's have a quick look in here. What do we need for a wreck saddle? What kind of types of wreck saddles can we get? We don't need alpha ones. We just need a regular Rex saddle. This one right here. Fiber, hide, metal. <laughs> so cheap. It's so cheap. I collected like I collected like so much fiber today. I just don't know where it's gone or where I put it. It must be in here. Has to be in here. There it is. Okay. So we should be able to. What? Where? Why can't I? Where do I have to go to craft it? Rex saddle. In a smithy. All right. Throw it all in. How many of these can we get? Seven of them. We're going to need more. It's just more metal ingots. So that's that's easy enough to do. But I reckon that's all for today, guys. We have ourselves a 90 Rexus. We, of course, are going to keep the... Wait, whoa, Roberta. What are you doing all the way over there? Roberta, what are you doing? Get inside the base. Get up back here. 
Get back up here. Get inside the... Oh, now he's got no chance of getting in because everybody's crowding around. But it's all good, guys. It's all good. I'm going to keep on going with the breeding. Hopefully, by the next episode, we'll have like 20 or so of them. We can just take him to the boss, do what we got to do, and, and that'll be it. So if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to go ahead, push the thumbs up, make it rain those thumbs ups. I'll catch you guys in the next one very, very soon. Bye for now. Yeah.